everybody! I am here in front of my Christmas tree that we just put up last night. The kids are super, super excited about that. <clears throat> and I've got a few things here that I'm going to share with you. So I'll wait just a second and let some of you guys hop on. And hopefully you can hear me okay. If you want to let me know in the comments if you can hear me because I know I am back a little ways from my phone. So I want to make sure you guys can all hear me. All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and get started. And if you're just jumping in and you miss something of what I'm saying, you can always go back and watch the replay when I'm done. So as I said the other day a little bit, our family has been working for a few years on making our home more chemical free, on making our home safer and less toxic and getting rid of some of the chemicals in our home that aren't good for our bodies and for our children's bodies. And so I'm going to share with you a little bit about what I do and how easy it is for you guys to do the same thing. So this is a diffuser and we have, I think, probably five diffusers in our home. Hey, Kim. And this is called the Aria. So this is the Aria diffuser and this is Young Living's top of the line diffuser. This is kind of their Cadillac of diffusers. And this one I'm showing you because it makes an awesome Christmas gift. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I'm going to show you how easy it is to set up. So the first thing you do is you just take some water and you can use tap water. You don't have to use distilled water, nothing fancy. And you just lift this glass dome off and you pour the water in and there's a little fill line so you know exactly where to fill the water to. Then you're going to take whatever oil you want. You can use Christmas spirit or you can use lavender. Hi Maria. I'm showing you how to set up the Aria diffuser. I'm going to use Believe. This is one of my favorite, favorite blends. It's called Believe and it smells amazing. It just smells like Christmas to me. Uh, I love it all year round, but I especially love it at Christmas time. So I already put the water in. Now I'm just going to put a few drops of this in. And I'm probably going to put four to six drops. And the reason I'm putting that many is because I have a very large open concept living room, kitchen, dining room. So the Aria is great for large areas because it puts off a lot of vapor and it can really get a lot of essential oils into the air. Um, <laughs> thanks Maria. Well, you know, it doesn't happen overnight. We learn a little bit every day as we study, as we practice using our oils, as we educate ourselves about what things in our home are dangerous to our bodies and to our kids' bodies, and we just make one small change at a time. And over the years, that adds up to huge, big changes for your wellness and for your family's wellness. So I put the oil in here, and now I'm going to turn it on. And this um, diffuser actually has a remote, so you can turn it on. I'm going to turn it on, and it plays music. It comes preloaded with its own spa music, so you can have the nice spa music playing, or you can turn the music off and you can plug in your cell phone or your iPod or your MP3 player and play Christmas music or hymns or whatever music you want to play through your Aria's speakers. And that's really fun during when you have parties or guests over because it's a huge conversation piece. People will stop and look at this because it is a showstopper. So uh, it has other settings on here. You can set it for different up lengths of time to diffuse. You can change the colors of the lights. There are lights inside this globe. You can see them glowing and you can change those. You can turn them off too for if you want to diffuse at night because you don't want the light keeping you awake. So as you can see, this is already putting off some vapor. It does better. If, you can see it better if there's like a background. There you go. So you can see it's putting off the vapor and this is not smoke. A lot of people when they come by like our vendor booths or something, they will say, oh, what's that smoke? And it's not smoke. There's nothing hot. This is cool. It does not heat the oil because when you heat the oil, it actually denatures some of the beneficial constituents of the oil. So you don't ever want to heat your oil, your essential oil, because these are not just fragrance oils. Remember, these are actually beneficial for your body and for your wellness. So you want to keep all those good things intact by not heating it. So we've got this going. It smells amazing. That's the Aria diffuser. <clears throat> now this is another diffuser. 
This is called the home diffuser. This is their rose design home diffuser and it functions exactly the same way. It just doesn't have as many bells and whistles. So you just lift the top off, you put the water into the fill line, and again, it's just tap water. You don't have to use distilled water. Then you add your oils and you turn it on and the vapor comes right out the top. <clears throat> There's another diffuser, the one I showed you the other day, the Dewdrop. That one's in here. That's the one that has more of a um, really minimalistic kind of understated look that goes really well with a lot of home, people's home decor. So that is what we call aromatic use for essential oils. Aromatic use means it's going into the air, you're breathing it in, it's falling on your skin, it's falling on your hair, it's purifying the air, it's purifying surfaces in your home, your children are enjoying it, your pets are enjoying it. It's a very safe therapeutic way to use essential oils. So that is one way that we use essential oils and it's great for when you're wanting to make your home more chemical free because your home can smell amazing and you can get rid of your Glade plugins, your Febreze, your candles that are toxic. All of those fragrances are toxic when you're breathing them in. They cause cancer, they're terrible, get rid of them. One of the number one ingredients in Febreze is formaldehyde. I mean, people, that's what we get embalmed with at the morgue. You don't want that in your home, I guarantee you. So this is a very safe, very therapeutic way for your home to smell amazing all year round. Okay, so that's aromatic use. Another way we can use essential oils is topically. And topical use for essential oils just means putting essential oils on your skin, on your body, or if you have animals, on their fur or on their paws or on the pads of their feet. So this is the premium starter kit I'm taking out here. These are the oils that come in the premium starter kit. Has a little easel on the back so you can set it up. So I'm gonna set it up here and we're gonna take out lavender. Lavender is a wonderful, we like to call it the gateway oil because it's so easy to use. It's so versatile, it has so many amazing, um, my accent, I have an accent. <laughs> I've never been told that, but thank you. Uh, so lavender is an amazing gateway oil. It's really easy to use. It's very gentle. It has all kinds of uh, benefits for your body, for your emotions. If you have children, if you have babies, it's wonderful for relaxing, for helping them sleep. It's also great for skin. If you've got any kind of skin issue, say you send your kids outside, and they play and they do what kids do, especially toddlers, and they come in and their skin needs a little bit of TLC, then you grab your lavender or your purification and you find that spot that needs attention and this is pretty much what you do. I mean, it's very, very easy, nothing complicated. You can rub it right on. I like to put it in a spray bottle because then I don't have to touch. Usually the kids, when they have an owie, they're, mommy, don't touch, don't touch. So I put it in a spray bottle and I could just go and it goes right on and no more worries. Um, it smells amazing. So you're also enjoying it aromatically, right? So you're enjoying it topically and aromatically. Now, if you have very young children or pets, there are um, guidelines for uh, diluting the oil. So you could dilute it with a carrier oil and that would be something like olive oil or coconut oil or pretty much any uh, safe oil that you have in your house. I don't recommend a petroleum based oil or a genetically modified oil like canola oil or corn oil or soy oil. So jojoba oil is great, coconut oil is great, olive oil is great. Young Living also makes a carrier oil that you can buy too if you want. Um, so lavender, that is topically, that's a way we use essential oils topically. So another way to use essential oils is internally. And that is actually one of my favorite ways to use essential oils because I'm a huge foodie. And if you follow me on Facebook, you will see I'm posting all the time recipes and I make drinks and food and all kinds of stuff. And I'm always trying something new in the kitchen. And so I love to experiment using my essential oils in the kitchen. So for example, last night when we decorated the tree, um, I made some peppermint hot chocolate. And I made peppermint hot chocolate 
with my peppermint vitality essential oil and I just put everything in the Vitamix and I blend up some organic chocolate uh, and some raw milk and some peppermint vitality essential oil and I just put one drop in there one drop will flavor probably three or four cups of hot chocolate and it it tastes incredible it is it's just until you actually taste it you will not appreciate how strong these oils are how potent they are and a little really does go a long long way with the oils the citrus oils are also amazing to use internally like lemon lemon's great to put in your water helps me drink more water it's also very detoxifying so when you drink essential oils in your water they help to penetrate the cell walls and actually dissolve toxins that are stored in your cells and help your body excrete them get rid of them so it's really good to be sipping on water with lemon or peppermint or spearmint is another great one to help rid your body of the toxins that we get no matter how clean of a lifestyle we try to live we're always exposed to toxins even just in the air we breathe in the water we drink so it's good to be detoxing our bodies so that's three ways that we can use essential oils and i'm kind of doing a mini uh, intro to essential oils class when i teach the, the classes on the essential oils they're usually about an hour so i am really abbreviating everything so if you have any questions about anything i've said or anything i haven't covered just put it in the comments and let me know and i'll i'll cover it for you so we usually talk about how we use the oils topically aromatically internally um, some safety tips with the oils uh, if you're going to use an oil on a very young child, just make sure you dilute it first very well. Make sure you apply it to the soles of the feet. The soles of the feet is always the safest place to use an essential oil topically. And if in doubt, if it's, a, if it's an infant and a very young child, or if you're just brand new starting out, you can just diffuse. Diffusing is a very safe way to use oils around children and pets. Um, some other safety guidelines are don't ever put essential oils directly in your eyes or in your ears or on other sensitive mucous membranes such as your unmentionables. <laughs> now, that is not to say that I have never used essential oils that way, but it was not on purpose. <laughs> and I was fine. I survived. Uh, you just want to make sure you have a carrier oil handy. So if you do accidentally use some peppermint and you get peppermint on your hands and then you go change your contacts like my husband did and your eye is stinging make sure you have some carrier oil and all you have to do is put some carrier oil on your finger and just rub it over your eye and that carrier oil will draw the essential oil out of your eye and same thing with your ear if you accidentally get an essential oil in your ear you just use some carrier oil and it will dilute it right out if you ever use an oil on your skin and it feels too tingly or too warm on your skin, again, just apply carrier oil. It'll take that sting right out. And when you do feel that, that's nothing negative. It's not harmful. You're not going to go blind. You're not going to go deaf. You're not going to have a chemical burn because our oils have nothing synthetic in them. There's nothing in them that's going to harm you but it may just be uncomfortable because of the increased circulation. It's kind of, um, it's kind of like if you were to rub, it's like friction. If you were to rub your skin, you know, really quickly for a while, it would start to get hot. Well, that's what it's like when you put the essential oils on because the molecules are so tiny, they're penetrating your skin very quickly and they're drawing a lot of blood flow to the surface of your skin. And that's what causes that tingling feeling with some of the hotter oils like thieves or peppermint. Now, other people love that feeling, and I absolutely love that feeling if I've been too long over my computer or working in my garden, or if you're a guy and you maybe you're doing some really heavy manual labor, or if you're working out at the gym, you want that nice tingly feeling for your muscles and for your joints. So you grab a, an oil like Panaway or an oil like... Um, Oh, let's see, what's another great one? RC is great to rub on your chest to give you that nice opening feeling for your lungs and your sinuses. <clears throat> if you take that pan away and you rub it on your shoulders or your knees or your low back, you're gonna immediately feel the benefits of that cooling sensation. All right, so that is some more ways you can use oils topically. We talked about some safety tips. Oh. 
Never use essential oils in plastic. Always use essential oils in glass or stainless steel. So if you're adding oils to your water, put them in a glass mason jar or a glass cup with a stainless steel straw or a glass straw. That's how I like to drink my oils because like we mentioned earlier, the oil's job is to get rid of toxins in your body. So what they do when they come in contact with plastic is they start dissolving that plastic. They're trying to get rid of that toxin that they're in contact with. So if you put them in plastic, they will leach the toxins out of the plastic and you're gonna end up drinking that in your water. So you don't want to use essential oils in plastic. Always use glass or stainless steel. All right, so those, any questions about any of the oils in the Premium Starter Kit? Um, the oils that come in the Premium Starter Kit are frankincense, Copaiba Vitality, which is incredible for maintaining and supporting wellness. This is a great one. I just put it right under my tongue. It's very, very mild. It's a great one for little kids to rub on their gums. I know Maria has some experience with her little girl rubbing Copaiba on her gums. Um, peppermint, again, I mentioned earlier how you can use that. Lemon, thieves. Thieves is amazing. I could teach an entire class just on thieves. And we're gonna talk about some thieves products here in a minute. Purification, RC, great for anything respiratory, sinus. Um, Digize, as the name kind of implies, it's amazing for anything um, digestive. You can rub it on your um, your, your abdomen, you can take it in a little bit of water or in a capsule. Um, lavender, we talked about that earlier. And then Panaway, we mentioned a couple uses for that. Another oil that comes in the Premium Starter Kit that's kind of an extra is one that every mom, well pretty much any person, but especially moms, will appreciate and that is Stress Away. Stress Away. This is an amazing oil. It smells like the most lovely perfume. It has vanilla and lime in it. I put my roller fitment on there so it has a roller ball on there and you can roll it right on your wrists. You can roll it on your neck. Whenever you're feeling like you need a little bit of uh, time out, I like to call it a vacation in a bottle. Throw this in your purse when you're out running errands with your kids or anything else that's stressful and you've got this at, at your fingertips. It's also great for using on your kids. Kids tend to get a little bit stressed. I mean, life is overwhelming for a kid, especially with school and with the holidays and with maybe travel and vacation and long car rides. Have this one with you. Digize, that's another one to have with you on long car rides. That has been a savior more than a time or two for us. A bunch of other goodies come in here. Um, there's graphics in the Young Living Essential Oils album in this event that show everything that comes in the Premium Starter Kit. But there's a bunch of other samples and goodies and little bottles and stuff in here. Um, the total retail value of this Premium Starter Kit that comes with all of those oils and a diffuser is over $300. That's the total retail value for this kit. It is the price for this kit, your cost as a wholesale member is only 160. And right now, Young Living is including a free bottle of Christmas Spirit, which is one of our favorite blends to diffuse during the holidays. It's just so, so lovely. Um, Kim, no, you don't have to use a carrier oil with Panaway. Uh, you can if you want to. Again, it just depends on your comfort level. So if you put the pan away on and you're really liking that deep, tingling, penetrating feeling for your joints and your muscles, then leave it alone. You'll be just fine. If you feel like it's a little too strong for you and you want it to be less tingly, then you can rub a carrier oil on there on top of it. It's not going to lessen the effects. Um, so you don't need to be a martyr and just deal with the, the heat if it's too intense. Um, but if you like that, there's no need to use a carrier oil. I never do. I just rub it right on and, um, and just let it do its job, let it do its thing. Okay, so it comes with the Christmas spirit this month. And then today only until midnight tonight during this sale, if y'all want to get started with the Premium Starter Kit, which is absolutely hands down the best value, 
you use the link that I'll put in the comments that's also in the Young Living Essential Oils album that's in this group, and I will give you cash back 20 bucks. So really, this whole kit is only costing you 140 plus tax and shipping. So that is incredible. That is an incredible, incredible deal. Plus you'll get the free Christmas spirit. And uh, that has to be by midnight tonight though. And using the link that is in the Young Living Essential Oils album. And I'll also post it in the comments here. Okay, another perk that you get when you grab your starter kit with me is that you get all of the support that I offer for our team. And so people like Kim and um, who else was on here? Kim and Maria, they are in my team. So they bought their starter kits through me. And so I am their resource person. So they can come to me anytime they have a question, they can message me, they can come to my classes if they're local to me. I'm actually traveling to go see Kim next this weekend and do a class for her. So it's a huge, wonderful, fun community. We support each other. We have a secret Facebook group that we can add you to. We share recipes and tips. I have contests and giveaways, promos, all kinds of fun stuff in there. You do not want to miss out on being a part of that group. And that is an exclusive perk for our members only. So you can only get in there. You can't even find it. It's a secret group. You can't even find it unless you're one of our members. All right. Um, any questions before we talk about Thieves, the Thieves line? This line of products is based on the Thieves Essential Oil Blend that we, I mentioned briefly earlier. And the Thieves Essential Oil Blend is one that has years and years and years of history and studies showing how well it supports your immune system and it purifies the air and it purifies surfaces. And it is one you do not want to be without, especially during the winter time. When you're wanting to maintain your family's wellness, you do not want to be without Thieves. So they have taken the Thieves essential oil and they have created a whole line of products that are chemical free. I mean, not chemical free because my husband's an engineer and he's always reminding me, everything is chemicals, right? They're toxic chemical free. So they're safe, natural products for your home. And I have been slowly working on replacing all of my toxic products in my home. So the, the first thing I did, I think, was I replaced all my hand soaps. Because if you check um, on an environmental working group and you look up your hand soap, how toxic it is, especially if you're using hand soap with triclosan and fragrances, and your kids are probably using that, and you're probably using that a dozen times a day, especially during flu season when everybody's washing their hands, right? So they're always telling you, wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. Well, if you're washing your hands with something toxic, that's kind of defeating the purpose, right? So I replaced it with the Thieves-based uh, foaming hand soap. This lasts forever. And I actually cheat and make my own refills. You can buy the refills, but I actually make my own refills using the Thieves Essential Oil Blend and uh, Dr. Bronner's. It's an all-natural soap base that you can get on Amazon. It's fragrance free. You can get um, the Baby Mild, which is unscented, and I use that, and some Thieves Oil, and the rest water. And so it's really, really cheap. Great way to, to get rid of that toxic hand soap in your house. Um, laundry detergent, that's another huge one. If you're washing your clothes in toxins with fragrances, especially the dryer sheets are so toxic, the fabric softener is toxic, pretty much anything with a fragrance is gonna be toxic. Even the stuff that says, it's safe and say, says it's non-toxic like the seventh generation. If you look it up on environmental working group, you'll still see that it scores, some of them score a D, some of them score an F. Um, it's, it's really, it's called greenwashing when they tell you something is, is safe and non-toxic and it's really not. So um, this is, and it looks like a tiny little bottle, but it actually has 64 loads. And more than that, I think if you're using an HE high efficiency washer, that light is on my face, sorry. Um, because you use less. You use a tiny, tiny, tiny bit. You can see how small this cap is and you only use half of this cap. And it has almost no smell. Like I could stick my nose in here and smell almost nothing. And what you do smell is just the Thieves essential oil. So this I, I swapped out recently. 
Um, my dishwasher detergent, I swapped that out. Dishwasher detergent is incredibly toxic. If you've got little kids running around, they're inhaling all that vapor that's coming out of your washer as it dries. And I got to the point where I couldn't even stand in the kitchen anymore when I would run my dishwasher because that was so strong. Um, dish soap, regular dish soap, they make that as well. Again, very, very concentrated. You only use a little bit. Um, this is, you cannot be without this. I don't know if you can see that. This is Thieves Waterless Hand Purifier. So moms who have kids, um, anybody who's out shaking hands with people, when we do vendor events, we bring this stuff by the gallon and we're using this all the time. And I have a funny story about this, this hand purifier. My son is three and we went to the VA hospital recently to visit our grandpa who was in the hospital. And Elijah, my son is three and he's so used to me using this thieves hand pur purifier on him and it smells amazing. It smells like cinnamon and clove and Christmas time and it, it smells good enough to eat. Like you wanna lick your hands, it smells so good. And that's from the cinnamon and the clove and the lemon in the essential oil. And so he's used to that. So we go to the VA and I didn't bring this like an idiot. Normally I carry one in my purse, but I completely forgot to bring it. So we're there at the hospital and of course you know the hospital, nasty, nasty. I used to be a nurse and I've worked in the hospital and I know how nasty it is. So I grabbed the hand sanitizer out of the wall dispensers that they have all over the hospital, just the, the alcohol, regular hand sanitizer stuff. I grab that and I use them and I put some on his hands and he rubs it in and immediately goes and then he looks at me with the most pitiful expression of, of just um, like, mommy, what did you give me? He rubs that stuff, takes a big old whiff and goes, oh, <laughs> and I felt so sorry for him because he's used to the thieves house, thieves of um, hand purifier that smells amazing. And I give him that um, alcohol hand purifier from, from the wall and he was just like, so um, betrayed. That's the expression on his face, betrayal. Like, mommy, what did you just do? <laughs> so anyway, he's spoiled. He's an oily boy, he's spoiled. Fruit and veggie wash, again, your vegetables, fruits, even if you buy organic, you want, if you're washing them with something that has chemicals in it, again, it's defeating the purpose. Toothpaste, we replaced our fluoride-based toothpaste long ago with this. Another tip about this is you can use this to replace your deodorant. So deodorant, as we know, is highly toxic, highly carcinogenic especially if you're using the antiperspirant that has the aluminum and all that in it. Rubbing it on your underarms all the time and then wondering why you're getting breast cancer and lumps and things, you know, put two and two together. That is so, so toxic. So a long time ago, I started looking for a natural deodorant that actually worked for me. And every single one I tried just did not cut it. I tried Palms of Maine. I tried all these natural deodorants. And I would put them on and by noon, I could smell myself, you know, and it was not a good situation. So a friend told me, well, you can use the thieves toothpaste as deodorant. And I was like, um, what? I did not believe her. I thought that is weird. Why would you ever do that? Well, I went ahead and tried it because I'm that way. And you put a tiny, tiny bit, like less than a pea size amount on your finger and you just rub it into your pit after you wash and then rub it, you know, get another pea size amount and rub it in your other pit. And I use a separate, in case you were wondering, I use a separate tube for my arms and a separate tube for brushing my teeth. So I'm not using the same one for both things. Uh, and it is amazing, amazing. I have never found anything that works as well as this. I can put it on in the morning and I can go all day and I can take my shirt off at the end of the day and smell it and I can still wear that same shirt again the next day. There's no smell on the underarm at all. That is huge for me. I don't know if it's just me, but that's huge for me to be able to wear the same shirt twice in a row. And that is 
this stuff. And I started using this probably four years ago and I've never used anything else and I will never use anything else. It is just too amazing. So, uh, and then this is the big one. This is Thieves Household Cleaner. This stuff, guys, is the most economical cleaner you will ever buy. This bottle is 14 ounces and it makes, oh my goodness, it makes dozens and dozens and dozens of spray bottles, full 16 ounce size spray bottles of cleaner. This is a concentrate and this is about $20. I think it's like 20 or $22, but it makes dozens and dozens of spray bottles of cleaner. So it ends up being like less than a dollar for every ounce spray bottle you can't even go to Dollar General and buy 409 for a dollar. Not to mention that that one product, I have replaced everything. I use it to clean my mirrors. I use it to clean my toilets. I use it to clean my sinks. I use it to clean my wood floors. I use it to clean my kitchen sink. I use it to clean my counters, my cutting boards, my car, my uh, anything you want to clean, you can use this stuff for. It's safe, it's non-toxic. I put it in a spray bottle. This is the best part. Put it in a spray bottle and I give it to my six-year-old and my three-year-old and I say go clean the bathroom or go wash the baseboards or go wash the walls, wash all the little handprints off the walls or the light switches. My kids can go do my cleaning for me because I don't have to worry if they spray this in their eye or if they spray this in their mouth, they can rinse it out with water and they'll be just fine. It won't hurt them, it won't make them sick, I don't have to call poison control, it smells amazing, there's no toxic fumes, it's not gonna give them lung cancer, it's not gonna give them a headache. It's, as a mom, like to be able to send my kids to clean for me and not worry that they're being exposed to chemicals, that's just, oh, I can't even describe how awesome that is. So that is the Thieves, that's part of the Thieves line. They have a lot of other products too, um, but these are the core ones. These are the ones I use most often. They have replaced most of the toxic products in my home. So when you think about that, I mean, you've got cleaners, gone. Toxic cleaners, gone. Toxic laundry products, gone. Toxic dish kitchen products, gone. Toxic air fresheners and candles and plugins, gone. Um, what else? Toxic um, anything you get at CVS or Walgreens, gone. We haven't been to the doctor in forever. My kids are six and three. Neither of them have ever in their entire lives been to the doctor for an illness. Let me repeat that. Neither of them have ever been to the doctor for an illness in their entire lives, ever. They have never had an over-the-counter medication. They have never had a, a prescription medication, medication in their entire lives. Now, I'm not saying that they've been in perfect health every day since they were born because they're humans. They, they, you know, they have their, their issues, but they've never had anything that a natural lifestyle and our essential oils and supporting their bodies with healthy food and sunshine and clean water have been able to, to overcome naturally. And they love their oils. They come to me and they ask for oils all the time. So kids will gravitate towards things that they know are good for them and that they know are beneficial. And it's just so neat to see them loving the oils and using them and asking for them all the time. There's one right now. Hi. Hi. What are you doing? I, 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 I just went outside. You went outside? Yes. Come over here and say hi. Hey. This is Elijah. He's wearing his sister's clothes right now. They've been playing dress up. Do you love your oils? Yeah. What's your favorite oil? That one. That one? You like Believe? Yeah. That one smells really good, doesn't it? Yeah. Do you like it when Mommy puts oils in cooking? Not only really because when I eat them, they taste weird. What about when I put peppermint in hot chocolate? That tastes yummy. That tastes yummy. <laughs> what about my peppermint ice cream? Yeah. Yeah. All right. You having fun with butter? Yeah. Okay. I'm all cold outside. You got cold? Well, you better get a coat then. <laughs> all right. So I got a comment. Young Living is amazing. Yes. Young Living is amazing. Yes. I'm so glad your family is living healthier. It's and Daddy got this Bible for butter. Daddy got a Bible for butter? That's wonderful. 
that's one of the reasons we love doing this so much is because we get to see people's lives change. I don't know why it got dark all of a sudden. Um, we love to see people's lives change. It's just amazing. It, it, that is worth everything to see people get healthier and to see their homes get less toxic. And it's just incredible. Hey, Brittany, if you guys missed the beginning, if you're just now jumping on, go back and watch the replay. I covered all kinds of stuff. The whole beginning of the, um, of the video was kind of an intro class, like an abbreviated intro class. So you can go back and watch and get some tips on how to use the oils. I walked through the whole premium starter kit. Um, and, and this, this one basically, when we, when we put it on apple and we know it, it, it no weird. It's it's a spray. This is the the produce wash that we spray on apples. It's fruit and veggie spray. Fruit and veggie spray. That's right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, Phelan, what are you doing? I got a red thing on my mouth. You and Elijah. What you is it? You and Elijah. Let mommy finish. Okay. 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 Thank you. All right. So I'm pretty much done. Um, that is all that I had to share with you guys. But um, I will say before I go, the some of the specials that we have going. I mentioned earlier the price for this kit and the extra special that I'm throwing in. And then also um, right now, Young Living is having their Cyber Monday sale where they are offering free shipping on a uh, hundred of their essential oil singles and blends. So if you do go ahead and get your account set up with me, you can set up as a retail customer uh, and not have to buy a kit or you can set up as a wholesale, cust wholesale member and get your kit and you get also get the additional 24% discount off of any products you want to order, then you can go to their Cyber Monday link and you can order any of those 100 oils that are that are in that promo and get free shipping on that. Um, so lots of great deals going on, lots of amazing ways you can change your life for the better. Enjoy a non-toxic Christmas. Enjoy a chemical-free Christmas. Get rid of the candles, get rid of the scentsies, get rid of the plug-ins and start using things that are actually beneficial for your health. It was a pleasure and a joy to be able to share with you guys. Thank you for the comments and the feedback. If you have any questions after this is done, please um, put them in the comments and I'll still come back and uh, answer them for you. So uh, that is all I had. Bye bye. I wish you could smell this and uh, we'll talk to you guys later. Oh, bye bye. Bye. <laughs>